Welcome back to the channel. We have a major update that Luna Foundation Guard uh, official Twitter page has just outlined their full reserves, right? So as of Saturday, May 7th, 2022, the Luna Foundation Guard held a reserve consisting of the following assets. 8, 000, over 8,000 BTC. They have over 39,000 uh, BNB coins. They have over 26 million uh, USD, USDT. They have over 23 million uh, USDC and they have 1.9 million AVAX coins and they have over just under 700,000 UST which is interesting that they have less UST than they have of the USDC and USD, USDT which show kind of indicates how much confidence they had in their own coin um, very very interesting there and of course last, last but not least one point let's call it 1.7 lunar coins i'm sure many of you have more lunar coins than this currently right um so this is their full uh reserves and just and what i would say is this is good news at least we know that they have enough to pay back the people that have lost their capital so they can definitely uh make things right which is good news for all of you watching that may have lost money in this uh, project now consistent with its non-profit mission and focus on health on the health of the terror ecosystem beginning on may the 8th when the price of ust began to drop substantially below one dollar the foundation began converting this reserve to ust the foundation did so by the the foundation did so by directly executing on-chain swaps and transferring BTC to a counterparty to enable them to enter trade with the foundation in large size on short notice. LFG directly sold 26 million USDT, 23 million USDC for an aggreg aggregate of 50 million UST transferred 50,000 52,000 BTC to trade with a counterparty net of an excess of 5,000 just over 5 5.3 uh, BTC that they have returned for an aggregate of over geez 1.5 billion UST uh, very very interesting and someone said can you refund me that's funny um, so yeah what can we make of this number one at least we know that they have reserves to pay back uh people that have lost money as i said before um the question now is what are they going to do with the remaining uh reserves um you know i hold the same uh, view as many uh, of a lot of big players in the game such as uh, the binance founder he as i said to you guys in the previous video he doesn't even believe that a fork should happen um at least not until everybody that uh, everybody that lost their money in Luna uh, is made right. And of course, he doesn't believe, and neither do I, that um, you know we should just create a new coin with the same coin supply, which would be one billion, and then just issue out those coins uh, to people that have lost money. Because essentially, you're just printed. You just basically printed uh, a new coin uh, out of thin air uh, that realistically has no value no intrinsic value and you, you're essentially just giving that out to uh people that have lost money on the old coin um when you actually have bitcoin there to actually re, you know to recompensate people so i believe that as well i don't believe that any fork should happen until people are made right uh, in some way um but yeah we're gonna see what happens anyway i'm gonna be keeping you guys up to date on any major updates this is significant that we all understand that at least we know that this project has capital behind it and as i said to you guys before do Kwan, the team will have nowhere to go really if they want to be taken seriously if they want uh, to, to their name to be at least even if this, this goes complete let's say they lose everything right they lose all all of their reserves by paying people back at least they have one thing and that's it honor respect and dignity and at least they can go on to do new things but without that yes i guess they can run off with the reserves but guess what they will be lepers in the community they are very unlikely to, to you know to, to be involved in any new projects and if they are they will literally be hounded to the ends of this earth so i think they know what to do 
uh, and hopefully they get this done. I'll be keeping you guys up to date on new updates. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And as always, click the bell notification icon so you can stay up to date with all my recent videos. Remember, guys, nothing that you've seen in this video is financial advice, so always make sure to do your own independent research. Pause the video, click the link in my description, and join the Telegram group so you can stay up to date with all my recent updates, news updates, technical updates, and much, much more. Until the next update, guys, seize the day. And remember, when others are fearful, be greedy. When others are greedy, be fearful. And if you want to stay up to date with our lunar updates this week, especially price updates and what we think is going to happen next, make sure you subscribe now.